Hey Dieter, this is Josh here. I just wanted to take an opportunity to walk through this car with you that you're looking at purchasing. This is the GLS 550. It's the larger engine that you were driving right around the 101. Um, and I just wanted to give you a quick breakdown on it. I'll call you in a little while, but uh, this is a good one to have. So first off, uh, walk through the vehicle. It's gonna have the night package, which is gonna give us our um, nice wheels. Those are gonna be AMG wheels, 21 inch up here. We're gonna have the fender flare because it is the 550 kind of give us a little more performance um, and because they will have the wider tires on them to kind of captivate that a little bit. Um, as we go down the lines, we're going to have our running boards. We're also going to have um, our night package, which is going to give us our black trim throughout instead of the standard chrome. Um, as we walk back, we'll open it up a little bit, get inside. This is going to have the real black leather. Uh, I know that you had uh, you guys like this a little bit more. Um, felt a little more roomy there and a little easier to get into. So this is also gonna have that poplar wood trim, which is a darker, but there is some active hues in there. I don't know if you can see it in the video too well, but it is there. Um, it is real wood underneath the lacquer there. Um, so a really nice driving compartment. On top of your wheel, you're gonna have some of that um, poplar wood trim as well. Um, we'll walk around to the back seat. I know you got the dog that likes to traverse the vehicle at all angles, so um, a lot of space back here, definitely a lot of space. We're also going to have our third row in the rear, um, so the seats will lift up to get back there. I know you won't use it too often, but it is there, um, can't seat adults, and it's very roomy. Um, let's go around the rear. Power lift gate, obviously. Uh, Decent amount of storage back here um, for the most part. We're going to have a, our full-size spare here. Uh, well, donut spare down here as well. Um, the seats are going to be power, which you'll see me reaching over here. And we can fold those down with the push of a button. Both sides, and they do lay down flat. So now we have a ton of space. Um, again, power lift gate will close that down for us. Um, We'll talk about the hitch. I know you guys were talking about maybe possibly a boat. This will tow up to 7,500 pounds, um, which is a lot of towing capacity. Um, through, uh, we'll come up to the driver cockpit just to kind of touch up on the, the last of it here. So the driver cockpit, we're gonna have uh, obviously the wood, which I did go through. It's gonna have that nicer steering wheel, the black leather, good feel. I know you're a bigger guy. Um, and, and it, you like the space up here. So there is a lot of space on our GLS. Um, we're going to have our, up here, the heated seats and the heat, the ventilated seats as we did go through the dual zone climate control. And down here, we're gonna have our um, sport modes and uh, selectors for snow mode and so on and so forth, which I know you really like uh, driving in the sport mode there. So we'll have all of that. This does have uh, some Distronics and some different uh, controls for our cruise control, which we'll get into momentarily. Um, I think you got it in the video there as well. We're gonna have the panel roof, so big roof um, up there as well. So around the front, um, we're going to see the intelligent LED headlamps, which those are gonna turn when you turn. So those are the bright ones. They'll change height and everything like that when you're going through a neighborhood. So they are very nice. These are our best headlamps that we do offer. So um, we're also gonna see here, since this is glared out, we're going to have the Distronic, which is our adaptive cruise control. So it will follow the vehicle at your speed or at their speed. If somebody pulls out in front of you, then it's going to slow down for them. And then it's eventually going to pick back up pace. It'll keep in your lane. If you recall, when you were driving it, you had the orange amber lights for your side blind zone alert. And what that did is it turned red. In that event, when it does turn red, when you try to change lanes, when that car is there, it will deter you from doing that and it'll steer you back in your lane so you don't side swipe somebody. So it is a cool state safety feature. It will also slam on the brakes for you if you were to be in a front end collision or anything of that nature as well. You're also going to see underneath each mirror um, a camera as well as on the front grill below our Distronic here, you're going to see another camera. And what that is, is that's where it pieces together your 360 view camera to kind of give you those all angles when you're parking. You can see the lines beside you. I did show you that guy, uh, 
show that to you when we were demoing the vehicle as well. So just wanted to give you a quick uh, breakdown on the vehicle, a very sharp car, and I'll call you shortly, but uh, this is just kind of a, a good teaser and a good refresher on what we did talk about. So we'll talk soon. Thanks.